in that creamer is milk, sweetened condensed milk, and chocolate syrup for the mocha flavor that I, we've been using. Um, and I've been buying Hershey's syrup. Um, but as you know, Hershey's has a lot of chemicals in it. And I hate that. So, um, and I've been trying, I tried this Hershey's, Hershey Simple 5. And it's got sugar, organic, invert syrup, water, cocoa, natural vanilla flavor. I don't know what organic invert syrup is. So it's okay. Um, it's better than regular Hershey syrup, which has a bunch of stuff that I cannot even pronounce. Um, I did have to buy some at the store. Oh, I threw it out. Um, but I did have to buy some at the store the other day. And it has a bunch of stuff that I can't pronounce. Just go look on the back of it. So anyway, we are going to make our own chocolate syrup. And my recipe has sugar, water, vanilla, and cocoa powder. That's it. Um, so you're going to start off by getting a pan, putting it on the stove, and now we'll get the ingredients. So you're going to put one cup of water and you're going to turn your stove on medium low. And then you're going to add one cup of sugar. So one cup of water, one cup of sugar. We have that on medium low. We're just going to stir it until you can stir this until the sugar is dissolved. There's a Dutch um, market by me, like, I don't know, 30 minutes from my house. And I went there for the first time the other day, and they have a ton of um, bulk items. Um, and I got some Dutch cocoa powder. Um, it's 0.44 pounds, and I paid $1.98, which isn't too bad. Um, all organic, all natural, whatever. Um, they have a bunch of stuff there. They have flour, they have sugar. I mean, they have homemade pastas. They have, like, stuff that they canned. Fabulous store. Um, so just wanted to throw that in. Well, it's almost dissolved. I feel a little bit of sugar left in there. Um, we're just going to stir it a little bit more. And then once it's all dissolved, we're going to add one third cup of the cocoa powder. And then you're going to stir that in. Make sure it's all combined. Make sure it's all off the sides here. And then you're going to keep stirring until it's all combined. And then you're going to bring it to a boil. All right, it just started boiling. Just started boiling. And now you need to consistently stir this for three minutes. So I'm going to set a timer because I am very impatient and I will probably stop stirring before then. Okay, now we are going to remove, we're going to remove from the heat. So it's removed from the heat. We're not letting it cool or anything. We just removed it from the heat. Now we're going to add one tablespoon of vanilla. And I can't find my tablespoon, so I have two half tablespoons here. Okay, a total of one tablespoon. And then you're going to stir it. And that's it. Then you're gonna cool it down. Sorry, my dogs are going nuts. You're gonna cool it down and then put it in a container and store it in the fridge like you would any other Hershey syrup. So 
So enjoy.